Oh, this is gonna be great. Just think, Calm. As soon as I get this camera set up, I'll be able to live stream my first ever viral science video, just like my friend Ryan. Say, Leo, I was thinking perhaps I could have a segment in which I discuss the periodic table. Uh, we'll see. This is kind of supposed to be my channel, you know? Excellent. I'll start brainstorming segment names. Calm time. Communicating with Calm. Come on and feel the noise. Akura? Sorry, Akuro. I can't let you be on camera either. I don't want to reveal my Elamon secrets to the whole internet. But don't worry. People watching will still learn all about the elements that make you. That's something, right? Akka! Okay, camera's ready. Five, four, three, two... Wait, how's my hair? Oh, you don't have hair. Oh, right. Action! And we're live! Welcome to my first ever live stream, viewers. You're about to witness the coolest science lesson ever put on the internet. Status report. You have two viewers. Never tell me the stats, Calm. Now, let's get started. Welcome to... Intro to Basic Chemistry, starring me, Leo Woods. We should have workshopped that name a bit more. Today, I want to introduce you all to the wonderful world of elements. Uh, -huh. uh <clears throat> for no other reason than, uh, chemistry is awesome. Definitely not because I have a big secret that involves transforming elements into powerful monsters. <laughs> nah, no way. Smooth. To begin with, everything in the universe is made up of little particles called atoms. Those atoms are able to come together and form what are called elements. I heard elements. Does that mean it's time for my segment? No, Calm. Aww. Uh, apologies for that disruption, viewers. Make that viewer singular. One must have logged off. Not listening. Now, where was I? Um. Every atom has a core called a nucleus that is surrounded by swirling little bits called electrons. Inside the nucleus are protons, which have a positive charge that counter the electron's negative charge. Uh, drop a comment if this is all making sense. Status report, zero comments. Okay, well, um, anyway. Atoms that come together to make an element all have the same number of protons in their nuclei. That number is called the element's atomic number. And that atomic number appears on the periodic table of elements, which I'll be going over now. Won't I, Leo? Um. Oh, come on. That would have been the perfect segue. <clears throat> elements are pure substances that cannot be broken down into simpler substances by chemical reactions. Now, what the? Ella, what are you doing? This is my super viral video, not my little sister's. Leo, I know chemistry is awesome, but if you really want to make a viral video, you're going to need to include some popular dance trends. This is not Ella's dancing video. This is Leo's science video, period. Period? As in periodic table of elements? Ooh, can I go now? Leo, please? I know that wasn't the cleanest segue, but you're not giving me much to go on here. Okay, okay, fine, do your segment. Yay. Welcome all you science heads to Comms Chemistry Corner. Today I'm going to be counting down my top three favorite elements on the periodic table. Coming in at number three, iron. Chemical symbol, Fe. Classification, transition metal. Atomic number, 26. And remind us, Leo, what does the atomic number signify? Number of protons in the nuclei of those atoms. Come on, smile. You'll never reach a million followers with that negative attitude. You are correct, Leo. And Ella, you are correct, too. Leo, you could stand to smile more. Iron is, by mass, the most common element on Earth. It can be found in the Earth's crust, in water, and even in your human body. About three to four grams of iron are flowing through your bodies right now. Neat, right? Haku! Uh, gesundheit. Now it's time to move on to my second favorite element, gold. Chemical symbol, AU. Classification, transition metal. Atomic number, 79. Gold has long been considered valuable because of its lustrous color, its near indestructibility, and the fact that it appears in nature in mostly pure form. 
meaning you can pull it out of a riverbed as is and basically strike it rich then and there. Or you can win a gold medal for your awesome totally on trend dance moves. That's correct, Ella. You, uh, go, girl. Thanks, Con. At least somebody is supportive around here. Now the time has finally come to reveal my number one favorite element. And now it's time for Com's number one favorite element. My number one favorite element is a tie. That's right. I just can choose a favorite between hydrogen and oxygen. They're both incredibly vital elements. Hydrogen, or H on the periodic table, is the most abundant substance in the universe. Oxygen, or O, is necessary for human beings to survive. How could I pick? I don't know, Colin. That kind of feels like a cop-out. Yeah. That's like me saying my favorite food is strawberries and yogurt. Which, actually, now that I think of it, sounds pretty good. Exactly, Ella. Because as incredible as these two elements are on their own, they're even better when you combine them. By adding two hydrogen atoms to one oxygen atom, you get the chemical compound H2O, or water. A colorless, flavorless substance that is necessary for life on Earth. Okay, that's kind of a good point. I told you, I'm the king of segways. All right, I think that wraps up chemistry content with Calm. It's Calm's Chemistry Corner. All right. Uh, out of curiosity, what's our view count at? Hmm, it appears our view count spiked at the three minute mark. That's interesting. According to my calculations, that appears to be the exact moment that all three of us were on camera together. I knew it! The internet loves dancing! Wait, we're receiving some comments. Hmm, according to the viewers, they specifically love the combination of dancing and science. Of course! I should have known! Just like how a chemical compound combines elements to create something new, our channel combined dancing and science to create something totally unique! Yes! yes! I'm sorry for trying to hog the video all to myself, guys. I should have known. Just like in chemistry, sometimes combining different elements produces the coolest effects! That's okay, Leo. Why don't we try this whole thing again? Sounds great! Take it away, you two! Meanwhile, me and my co-producer will man the camera. hook Now you'll see Ella here is expelling carbon dioxide as she dances, or CO2. CO2 is a chemical compound made of two oxygen atoms and a single carbon atom. The CO2 in our air...